Hi, my name is Brittany Eclisson, and this report will be about the scrawled cowfish saw out in Key West during our spring break trip. Marine life in the Keys. The Florida Keys offers a range of habitats providing homes to a wide variety of animals. Highlights along the way include Key Largo, Isla Mirada, Marathon, Big Pine Key, and the irrepressible Key West. As a member of the family Ostracidae, the scrawled cowfish is a close relative of boxfish and trunkfish. It is found in the tropical and temperate waters of the Atlantic Ocean. It lives in shallow water, primarily in sea grass beds to depths of 262 feet. I actually saw this species at the campgrounds in shallow water during our 24-hour labs as well as in, well, at Bahia Honda Bay State Park as we went snorkeling. Its diet includes a sessile, sessile invertebrates such as tunicates and gorgonians. Here are some more facts about the scrawled cowfish. The biology of the species is covered with hexagonal shaped dermal plates that are securely fused together to form a carapace. That's pretty much similar to a turtle shell, but this isn't a turtle so it isn't as hard as that shell. It's just used as another defense mechanism or pretty much just for protection. There is also a pair of spines projecting from in front of the eyes, which is similar to appearance of cow horns, which is how it pretty much gets its name of the cowfish. The, um, the color is typically grayish brown to yellowish green with traces of blue running throughout its exterior. It can grow up to a maximum of 22 inches, but is commonly known to be about eight inches. Here are some of the images of the live footage found at Bahia Honda State Park. And here's an image found at the, t um, the campground during the 24 hour labs. Here's a little chemistry behind the species. The main defense mechanism of the species is its chemical toxin secreted when, when under stress. The toxin secreted is pyrotoxin, which is a water soluble crystalline chemical contained in the mucus and secreted through the skin. It is a chloride ester and when released quickly dissolves and negatively affects any fish in the surrounding area. These toxins are similar to detergents, which has a potential to interfere with receptor mediated processes in marine life. Here are some other finds found out in Key West. A conch shell, a GQ model, a Caribbean starfish, a real model and friendship. I have a big thank you to the TAs and our professor for making this an awesome experience and that's all I have for you guys.